So these are the Pokemon cards I have. It starts on this page with a Geriachi. I don't know what that is. I'm not going to try to pronounce some of these. I could I could pronounce them back when I was a kid. I can't do it anymore. I'm not even going to try. YouTube promo card. What kind of shape is it in? It's not bad. It's not great. I have an Entei. It's in bad shape, though. I got it for free because some kid didn't want it. He didn't like it. And he, like, it's got tape on it. And it's cracked or whatever, but... If you were a kid back in the day, you remember, if you had an Entei, you were the shit. You were the cool kid. So I didn't even care that it was in rough shape. I was just like, a free Entei! This is my holographic Pikachu. It's in not bad shape. And it's my first edition Machamp, but it's, as you can see, like, it's got a wrinkle across it. First edition Misty's Polyrath. What kind of shape is it in? Well, it's not bad shape. First edition Snorlax. What kind of shape is it in? Oh yeah, it's got a wrinkle in it. Yeah, on the side there. Hang on. There we go. So that one's in rough shape. That's my second first edition Machamp. This one's in a lot better shape. There's no wrinkles or anything. There's some fading. On the edges there's fading, but there's no wrinkles or so it's it's not bad. It's not great. Magneton first edition. There's some scratches on it, some fading. First edition Flareon, what kind of shape is it in? in decent shape a little bit of fading but not bad surge is right you first edition pincer what kind of shape is that in oh that one's in decent shape too but those are the those are all the ones that that guy was looking at when he was looking at my cards Dragonite. This is the movie card when I went to go see the movie. That's in decent shape too. Another Machamp. I got three Machamps.
first edition Psyduck. What kind of shape is it in? That one's in not bad shape either. Make the might. Another magneton. The guy came and he offered me 150 bucks for all of them. He said they were in rough shape and that's the best he could offer me for them. So I said, well, if they're not worth anything, I might as well just hang on to them. And some of them are in, like I, like I showed, they are, in, they're faded and some of them are in pretty rough shape. But there's some, there's a few of them there that are pretty decent. Like they're not mint, not by any means, but they're not terrible either. I told him, I'm just like, well, if they're, he's like, well, what were you thinking? I was just like, well, if they were worth over a thousand, I'd let them go. But if they're not worth over a thousand, I might as well hang on to them. There's no point selling them. He said, well, what are you going to do with Pokemon cards? I said, well, what am I going to do with a hundred bucks? Like, at least these, if I have kids someday, maybe I'll give them to them and they can, I can tell them all about the fucking Pokemon craze back in the day when I was a kid. like if something's not something from your childhood is not worth anything doesn't mean you have to get rid of it
he wanted to buy he's just like well since i came all the way down here would you sell me your pikachu and i was just like no i'd, I'd rather just keep the whole set i knew it's the only pikachu i had so i was just like no i'll keep it These are all trainers. <clears throat> Energies. And then at the very end, I got... I got one more there. And then another trainer. And then I got these collector cards. I think I got these at McDonald's or something. And these are all holographic collector cards. Oh, frick, the Brock's got a wrinkle in it. I don't remember it having a wrinkle in it. Mechanical Mewtwo, holographic. But yeah, that's it. That's my Pokemon card collection.